Yonaseo, today is day number 64 here in Busan, South Korea, and today we had a game against the LG Twins in which the Lotte Giants were victorious 7-5. to And obviously it's nice to have a win, but today we almost had a brawl as well. The bench is cleared after our right fielder and other foreign player, Kareem Garcia, ran over the catcher. Now, the nature of baseball in Korea is a little bit different than it is in the United States. Um, Kareem was hit by a pitch when he got on first base, and then there was a ground ball hit to first base when Kareem came home and was thrown out by a few feet in, at home plate. And in the U.S., usually a catcher would get a low center of gravity and put a tag on Kareem when he slid, or the catcher would get out of the way and just tag Kareem while he was coming to home plate. Well, this catcher held his ground, which is very unusual. And in the U.S., the catcher would get run over, and that's what Kareem did. He really blew up the catcher. And then both benches cleared because the pitcher then ran after Kareem. And, man, it was actually quite a sight. And uh, the umpires warned both benches later on. And then Kareem got hit again um, on the third pitch of the at-bat, which is also very unusual um, because usually if you're going to hit a guy, you hit him on the first pitch. So just the nature of the way things are done here are very different. Um, so, yeah, we the brawl was probably something that I have never, or the almost brawl, it was a bench-clearing almost brawl because no punches were thrown. And then coaches were yelling at, Jerry, our manager, and, you know, obviously Jerry didn't understand what the coaches were saying, so our coaches took offense, and I don't know what, what really happened, because I didn't understand much of what was going on either. All I know is that it was different than what you would see in the U.S., so uh, I thought I'd share that. My first Korean almost brawl. That's all I got for today. The Chungin Mario.